Hello guys, today I'm going to teach you how to download Optifine for Minecraft on Mac El Captain. Uh, so just going to load up your Minecraft real quick as you saw those I did there when I went to my <clears throat> apps. And just you're going to want to wait for that to load up. And once it's loaded, you're going to want to go to your edit profile and choose, uh, make sure it's on use latest version because we're going to be installing the latest version of Minecraft 1.8.8. Just press play there. And you're going to want to wait for it to load up. Um, it's going to take a little bit of a while to load up on mine uh, as I was uh, uploading a different video while I was doing this on uh, the um, uh, one of my Minecraft videos, obviously. Uh, so my internet was a bit slow when I was trying to do some of the parts of this. Uh, but nonetheless, once it's loaded up, uh, you can simply X out of it. You don't need it up uh, currently. You just need to go to your web browser and you need to choose... Uh, Go to optifine.net, type in rather. And once you're to the website, um, you go to the downloads tab right here. And the latest one's always at the top. Just go to the mirror instead of hitting download. If you hit download, you'll have to go through an AdFly link, and it's just a obnoxious process. Just click that download and wait for it to download. I like just dragging it off to my desktop uh, so it's easier to delete later. Um, but you can drag it wherever you want, or you can just simply click it right off, off of Chrome and then delete it from your downloads. Uh, which is actually probably the best method to do it. I just was doing it for emphasis, dragging it to my desktop so that you guys knew what to do with it. Uh, so it is a jar file uh, for Optifine. If you're not using it for Forge, you just double click it. If you just want Optifine and you're not trying to get any mods besides that, and you're going to let it load up, and it'll, and it'll pop up a little thing like this. You just hit install, and that will install Optifine into your Minecraft folder as a version that you can use. Now, like I said before, I like keeping stuff clean, so I just uh, empty everything out right now because you don't need those files anymore and you don't need them taking up space that should not be being used. So just relaunch Minecraft now. Go to your launch pad if you have it there or if you have it on your dock. Simply just do that and launch the game back up. Um, as soon as it loads this time, you're going to do the same thing except for when you go to edit profile this time, you're going to want to choose the version of uh, Optifine, which is the, for me 1.8.8. And uh, wait for a little hit play again. Uh, like I said, it should be a bit quicker for you as if if you have faster internet or you're not uploading a video that's using up all of your internet so you can't use it. And once it's loaded, uh, you've basically completed it. Uh, Optifine is installed. Um, as long as you get no crash errors. If you do have crash errors or if you have any other extra questions, you can always leave those in the comment section below. But as you can see there, Optifine has been installed. And if you have any other questions, just leave them in the comment section below, like I just said. And drop a like and subscribe. Thanks.